You know this thing that returns an AI-generated image from keywords? It should probably show an ROG Strix SCAR-15 when given the words gaming laptop. Yes, this is a classic. The latest iteration is called G533, and it has everything a gamer might need, kitchen sink included. Tag along as we give you a quick tour of the new ASUS ROG Strix SCAR-15 G533. As expected, the build quality is top-notch, with a combination of plastic and aluminum that is very tough, thanks to the structural supports on the inside. The design includes a transparent part of the base and an RGB backlit ROG logo on the back. Then we have the signature armor caps, which you can customize through ASUS's website and 3D print later. ASUS borrows tech from its productivity and business laptops, sacking the traditional numpad and integrating it into the touchpad. The keyboard has 2mm travel distance and per-key RGB backlight, controllable via the Aura app. Going to the sides, we find two full-sized plus two Type-C USB ports, one of which is Thunderbolt 4. There's also an HDMI 2.1, so you can connect an external screen with 8K resolution or a 4K one with a 120Hz refresh rate. The LAN port has a bandwidth of 2.5 gigabits. There are two displays to choose from, both supporting Dolby Vision HDR and Adaptive Sync, 300Hz Full HD or 240Hz QHD. We chose the latter for our review, and we could totally recommend it since it has high maximum brightness, good contrast, and full sRGB and DCI-P3 color coverage. In other words, expect a cinema-grade picture quality. And it's really immersive thanks to the thin bezels and the quad-speaker audio setup. By the way, you can play as much as you want since our tests show no PWM across all brightness levels. Such a screen, in combination with powerful hardware, often leads to short battery life. Not this time. The G533 has a 90 watt hour unit that manages to last through 11 hours of web browsing or 7 hours of video playback. Only 2 per 100 people watching this video are subscribers. If you decide to just start following us, we'll be able to reinvest more in our laboratory thus making even more helpful videos for you. Thank you, you're awesome. The ROG Strix SCAR-15 G533 is well future-proofed, with two SODIMM slots for DDR5 memory, plus two M.2 PCI X4 slots with support for Gen 4 drives. Of course, these are the latest generation modules. Although the G533 can be ordered with up to RTX 3080 Ti, we decided to test a more affordable configuration with the 150-watt GeForce RTX 3070 Ti. Creatures. Because you can brew potions from their blood? <laughs> no, because by eating rotting corpses... They it's powerful enough face. to run games like The Witcher 3 they at ultra settings, with about 150 now, FPS on average. You can bring up the resolution to QHD or 4K and still get good frame rates and smooth gameplay. All configurations come with MUX switches, so the performance is unleashed even with the internal screen. And the processor options start from the Core i7-12700H, so you're safe from bottlenecks in that aspect too. As for the cooling, there is one heat pipe shared between the processor and the GPU, with two more dedicated to each of them. They are connected to four heat sinks, where two arc flow fans dissipate the heat. A sixth heat pipe is cooling the graphics memory and the VRMs, while the CPU sports a liquid metal thermal compound. This is a beast of a setup, as you can see in our temperature test. The Core i9-12900H in our configuration runs its peak cores at nearly 4 GHz for the entirety of the test, while the E cores barely drop below 3 GHz. All of that by sustaining 121 watts in long runs. Incredible! There are no issues with the GPU cooling as well. The G533 keeps its max TGP. Our opinion is that if you can afford it, the SCAR-15 should be on your shortlist, as it provides great qualities for both gamers and creators, and looks unique while doing so. Top-notch CPU and GPU performance, professional-grade display, strong construction, and stacked with RGB. Do you need anything else?
Of course, we can't leave it without cons, so we'll mention the lack of a web camera and SD card slot, but we know that most gamers will not even notice their absence. That's why we're awarding this notebook with our Editor's Choice Award. Of course, we've done a lot more tests, and you can check out all the results in our in-depth review on LaptopMedia.com. You'll find the link in the description below the video.